Hey guys, what's up? It's iPod Touch Helping here on iTech Masters YouTube account. And uh, today I'm going to be reviewing the Kodak PlaySport. Uh, the camcorder is obviously made by Kodak, as you can see right there, and they called it the PlaySport. So this is a really good camera if you guys are active, like if you, for example, if you go mountain biking and stuff like that, you carry this in your pocket, you want to take a quick video of it, go ahead. And also, it's perfect for swimmers out there. So as you guys can tell right here, I don't know if you can read that, but it says waterproof 3 meters, which is up to 10 feet. You're allowed to go underwater with this camcorder. Uh, it's definitely very strong, like it, you could drop this a few times, it definitely uh, can take some damage, but I mean, you wouldn't obviously want to drop it, but it, does, it is a pretty strong phone. So uh, I was actually just using this today, it's uh, in the water, so uh, it works perfectly fine. I, you, you can use it in salt water, normal water, whatever, it doesn't matter. So first things first, I'm going to get into uh, some of the stuff about this. So it, the camera, it is actually shoots in 1080p HD at 30 frame or yeah, 30 frames per second, and it also shoots 720p at 30 or 60 frames per second. It also takes 5 megapixels still pictures, um, so that's good. So this is definitely a very good camera. Uh, it's similar to the ZI8, but the ZI8 definitely has some better close-ups and stuff because this one has a very bad close-ups. If you ask me, that's why I don't make videos with this. But um, we'll get into uh, the things on the side here. As you can see, you open it up, you can put your S. Uh, you can put your SIM card in there and your battery, of course. And on the other side, we've got a couple different ports. We've got an HDMI port right there. And then right here, we've got the USB port. So uh, those two are definitely very useful. Obviously, I upload with USB and I can put it on the TV in HD right away from my camcorder. So that's really cool. So now to get into more of the technical stuff, guys. Uh, We'll just start off here. I'm taking a video and really right here you can just change from whatever mode you want. So as you can tell I got all these different HD modes and I got 5 megapixel camera. And it tells you how, how long you can record up there in the top left corner and also how many pictures. So I can take 999 pictures because I think I have a 4 gigabyte memory card in here. So, and, uh, so that's basically uh, what you do with the video and I'll show you some of the settings here. So, well, whoops, that's a picture. It's actually kind of cool. Um, it's my brother underwater, so that was one of the underwater pictures that I took. So that's definitely something pretty cool. Um, let me just show you guys the settings. There we go. So here we are in settings, and here we can just change a couple of different things, like the brightness, of course, and the audio. And you can change uh, how much you want to record, how loud, how quiet. H2O, so if you want to put it in H2O mode, that's also a really cool feature. Uh, definitely the number one feature why I got this um, because I do go to the pool a lot. There's a pool in my complex, so yeah. It's got image stabilization, face detection, and yeah, that's pretty much it for settings. But um, you can go through your pictures easily. You can delete them easily. That's pretty much all, guys, in this video. But after this, I'm going to show you guys a quick underwater video that I just took. Um, it's very bad, but... Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video and I'll catch you guys later. Peace. So this is a quick video test in 720p outside. No special modes on or anything. Just 720p, 30 frames per second. Just take a close up over here to these little flowers. There we go. The close ups in this guys are really not that great but uh, from far away, this is definitely a good camera. Definitely a good camera. Quickly do a quick zoom and then I'll show you guys some water footage at the pool. So there we go. This is the quick outside test. Let's move on.